Hey guys, Amen. We're here, and today we are going to be activating Windows XP in 2020. So join us. And since I don't have the VMware tools installed, it's gonna take a little bit. Call the number provided. Oops. And now we're going to call the number. Welcome to the Microsoft Product Activation Center. Para continuar en español, en prima dos, pour continuer en français, to help us improve the quality of our products, services, and training, this call may be recorded or monitored, and information collected on this call may be accessed by Microsoft affiliates, subsidiaries, and service providers internationally. To consent to recording or monitoring of this call, press 1. Or to continue without recording or monitoring, press 2. Thank you. This call will not be recorded or monitored. For security purposes, please enter the following number on your phone's touchstone pad. 159. I didn't hear anything. For security purposes, please enter the following number on your phone's touchstone pad. 159. Thank you. Welcome to Microsoft Product Activation. Now, which kind of product would you like to activate? Please say Windows, Office, or say it's something else. Windows. Okay, Windows. Are you at your computer with the activation screen open? Yes. Please say. To reduce your effort, we can activate your product using a smartphone display instead of our audio self-help system. To get started, I'll need to send a text message to a smartphone. Carrier text and data rates may apply. Now, would you like to give me a smartphone number so that you can use that phone to activate your product? No. Yes? All right, let's continue with voice activation. Okay, now take a look at your screen. I'll ask you to tell me the installation ID. The installation ID is a long number broken into several groups. I'll ask you for one group at a time. Please say or enter the digits in group one. Sorry, that didn't seem to be a valid group of digits. Please enter or say the first group, digit by digit. ID. You will need to use your keyboard to enter it in the empty blocks you see near the bottom of your activation window. As I read each six-digit group, I'll say which block it goes in. Now use your mouse and position your cursor in block A. Once I've read the 
entire confirmation ID back, you'll have the chance to hear it again. You can also say repeat to hear that block again. Are you ready to get started? Yes. Block A is 072932. Block B is 692122. Block C is 870162. Block D is 715963. Block E is 021625. Block F is 157110. To return to the very first block, say, start over. If you've finished entering the digits for all of the blocks, say, I'm finished. I'm finished. All right. Now please take a moment to write down that confirmation ID, because you can reuse it in the future if you ever need it. Go ahead. I finished. Entire confirmation number again. Block A is 072932. Block B is 692122. Block C, 870162. Block D, 715963. Block E, 021625. Block F, 836626. Block G, 157110. Did you get an error this time? No. Great. Your product has been successfully activated. Answer Desk is ready to help you with whatever you need. You can always find us at support.microsoft.com. Again, that's support.microsoft.com. We hope you enjoy your product. Thank you for calling Microsoft. Goodbye. So, yes, you can still activate Windows XP in 2020. Sorry for not the repeating solution ID. You can take it if you want. Um, I have no problem. So, thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time.